selling our resort um, to head over to the Riviera because we're going to Topolino's Terrace for breakfast which I'm so excited for because that restaurant just looks real nice doesn't it? It does. And the, um, there's loads of characters that you can meet and the food just looks really good so yeah very excited for that. Um, we're meeting Shannon and Ollie and Buzz though. Um, Tori and Nath were supposed to be coming as well but Nath's not feeling too well bless him so they're gonna pass today. Sunstroke. <laughs> they're gonna pass on the meal today um, but we have got other things booked with them like anyway so as sad as we are that they're not coming today we'll it's not soon. the end of the world we will see them soon um, but we're very excited to spend some time with Shannon and Ollie and Buzz um, and then especially Buzz <laughs> especially Buzz and then we're gonna head into Epcot after that because we can just get the Skyliner over um, so yeah we're just heading to the front now and we're just gonna get an Uber or a Lyft though just to save like going to a park and then getting a buzz or the Skyliner um, it's just gonna be easier and quicker to get a Uber or Lyft depending which is cheaper so yeah we will probably just see, see you when that. we're at breakfast <laughs> So Mickey's our painter, Minnie's our poet, Daisy's our ballerina, and John's our sculptor. Let's turn right over here. And then over here you can see our view. Wow. And you can see Epcot and Little Kingdom and Hollywood Studio. <laughs> Look at Buzzy trotting along. <laughs> so long, Come on, Buzz. Put your off shirt. You want to sit in your big Buzz? Buzz, you excited to get to meet Mickey today? Yay! Hey. And Minnie. And John. And Daisy. They will all come here for hugs, kisses. <laughs> and all that fun stuff, all right? <laughs> you have no idea what I'm saying. This is true. hopefully you all do. So. I love that Buzz loves Donald as much as I love Donald. <laughs> oh, well, welcome to our She's going to go Living his best life, meeting all the characters. Oh, <gasps> We're sat! 
you got a cake? Yes, yeah, sorry. <laughs> mm. Chocolate in a white t shirt. You're going to eat it. He's getting the chocolate out, he's getting the best of it. <laughs> There's only Buzz that's dipped into this yet. Are any of us going to do it? Donald is definitely Buzz's favourite. <laughs> <laughs> So much food on this table right now. <laughs> um, so me and Ben both went for the scrambled eggs. I got mine with sausage. Ben got bacon and sausage. And then we've got some little Mickey waffles on the side. <laughs> Buzzy's got his own little Mickey waffle plate. He doesn't look very impressed with it though, does he? <laughs> I'm impressed what with is it. that? Yeah, Buzzy. Yum. Look at these two just chilling here. Yeah, we're just, just living, living the lots, best lots, life. Lots, lots, lots. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which resort is that? Is that Caribbean, Caribbean Beach. Beach? Is that the main? So we finished up at breakfast night and we've just come out onto the little terrace at Riviera, like outside of Topolino's and the views from up here are so good. Um, Buzz is having a little run around burning all his energy off. <laughs> we're just admiring the views. Oh god! <laughs> Shan just had a mild heart attack. doesn't have the same Ben, come on. No! Look how windy it is, it'll just blow off. breakfast and that was really really good um we went on the skyliner to hollywood studios um and then got the buzzes from the back to our resorts um the plan originally was to go to epcot but it is so so hot today um so we've decided we're going to go and spend the afternoon at typhoon lagoon which will be really nice like all going to the water park together and just chilling getting like the weight off our feet going around the lazy river and stuff um so we've just come back to get into our swim stuff um and me and ben also just need to quickly pack a little case um because we're actually checking into animal kingdom lodge tonight um so i'll tell you a bit more about that like when we get there um but yeah, I'm really looking forward to spending the night there. Um, so we're just going to pack a case, take that to Bell Services at this hotel, and then they can transfer it over to Animal Kingdom Lodge like whilst we're at the water park. Um, so it's really handy that we're able to do that. Um, but I'm very much looking forward to taking my makeup off and just going, having a nice chill afternoon at the water park. Um, so yeah, me, Ben, Shannon, Ollie and Buzz, we're going to spend the afternoon at Typhoon Lagoon and probably just spend hours and hours going around the Lazy River, to be honest. 
Um, but yeah, breakfast at Topolino's was really, really nice. The food was amazing. Our server was lovely. She was hilarious. Um, really took a shine to Buzz, which was adorable. Um, and Buzz was obsessed with the characters, wasn't he, Ben? Yeah. He, um, he loved Donald. Um, so that was really cute. Um, so yeah, it's been the best morning. Um, and we're looking forward to like spending the rest of the day with our pals. So we've just got to Typhoon Lagoon. We're just waiting by the entrance because Shannon and Ollie and Buzz are going to be here in a few minutes. Um, it's in my hand, ready for when we're on the lounges. We've just had our first little, like, where we've noticed the cutbacks at Disney. Um, so obviously we mentioned in the room earlier that we're going over to Animal Kingdom Lodge. Um, so we were told yesterday at the front desk that we could take our cases to Bell Services and that they would transfer them over to the next resort. Um, and they said that like they go over like any time between one and five. Um, but she didn't say to us that they had to be there by a certain time. So we just took our cases at 20 past one and they told us that they'd already left and that they couldn't move them over. Whereas like previously, I feel like they would have just had multiple transfers <coughs> going. Obviously it's probably just like a miscommunication, um, but we weren't with able it. to send our cases. So we've brought them with us to Typhoon Lagoon, which is fine, it's not a problem. We can just shove them like under our sun lounges or whatever. Um, I just feel like when we've been to Disney previously, they would have just done it. Yeah, like Disney service, they would have just done it, but it's fine, it is what it is. Um, so we're just waiting for the other guys now and then we're gonna head in and it's absolutely boiling so I can't wait to jump in that lazy river or in the wave pool or something. I just wanna get in the water um, and yeah, just have a nice and chilled afternoon and then head over to Animal Kingdom Lodge later on. <laughs> Killed it! That's good. Cool. <laughs> Are you cute? Are we under the bridge? We're chilling. Splash! <laughs> 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 Shan have just been to Typhoon Tilly's Snack Shack and got some little ice creams. We were going to get some for the boys as well, but our lounges are like over the other side of the water park, so we're just we're just going to get those some from Nero. But I got the Montanui Island twist. And I got the Hey Hey! Hey Hey Cone! Um, but these look so good. Oh. They are melting now. I'm just going to be annoying. I'm going to have a green... Um... You have a green lip. <laughs> So we've had the best afternoon at Typhoon Lagoon, have we been? We have indeed. Um, we're just waiting for our Uber now to take us over to Animal Kingdom Lodge so that we can check in there. Um, we were fine taking our luggage into the park, into the water park. We just popped it under our sun lounger and it was absolutely fine. So even though it was a bit of an inconvenience, it wasn't a problem at all and they didn't bother like about us taking it in. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go over to Animal Kingdom Lodge. We've basically just spent the afternoon like in the little splash pad um, and going around the Lazy River. Me and Ollie did go on a couple of the um, water rides while you and Sham were looking after Buzz, didn't we? Me and Ollie went and did the, um, what was it, Mayday Falls and um, else for. I can't think of it though. Mayday Falls and Oh my god, I can't remember the name of it, but the ones that are like right next to each other. Um, so that was fun. Um, but yeah, for the most part, we were like all together, we're, we're just it like just chilling in the splash pad. Yeah, Ben, ben couldn't really be probably climbing up the stairs because no, you're in the heat. It's, it's been baking. Yeah, it has been really hot, but it's been a nice day for the water park, hasn't it? I was sat on like the little deck chair thing and I felt like a UFC fighter, like sweating, sweating out. Yeah, weight. sweating my body weight out to like make weight or something. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's been really nice and obviously because it was quite last minute and we only 
had the afternoon though we said we want to go back and do a full day um so we're going to try and plan that for when we can all go together again yep. um maybe in a couple of days when it's ollie's birthday we might do it then um and we've changed our park reservation for tomorrow to now go to animal kingdom haven't we because if we're already at Animal Kingdom Lodge, it just makes sense to like get on the bus. Yeah, it's not like a quick like bus, a isn't it? Two minute bus ride, if that. Um, but yeah, I think our Uber should be here in one minute. So it's just coming in now. It we'll looks be like. on our way to Animal Kingdom Lodge very soon. <laughs> There's some giraffes outside. Oh, oh and an ostrich. Look at it like rolling in the sand. It's an ostrich. <laughs> Do you think that was a oh, zebra though? Did you, think, did you not see the zebras? Did you think I thought an ostrich yeah. was a zebra? <laughs> well, the zebra's going to be on a tree. So we're at our hotel um, at Animal Kingdom Lodge in Kidani Village now. Um, so we need to like explain why we're here because it must seem a bit random us just doing like one night in the middle of our holiday. Um, we already had Port Orleans French Quarter booked um, for the eight nights. And then our next door neighbours, our very good friends, Becky and Dean, um, they had some DVC points um that were expiring before they were going to come back um so they very kindly let us buy them um at a really good price um so we booked one night in a one bed villa um at kidani village and this is just Amazing. incredible um so you might be wondering like have we checked out of french quarter to come here and then checking back in We've not. Um, we do still have our room at French Quarter, where we've left like the majority of our luggage. Um, obviously, it is a bit of a waste, like having that room as well. Um, but when we booked this, we'd already got French Quarter at a really, really good price with Virgin Holidays. But when we booked this, if we'd have cancelled that and rebooked like the two nights and then the following five nights after tonight it would have worked out more expensive than our original booking um, and then I think if we'd have wanted to amend ours there would have been like an amendment fee which would have been more than just keeping the night stay um, so even though we wouldn't usually just like have a night in a hotel room that we're not using it would have been more expensive for us to change it um but it's worked out well because it's meant that we've not had to cart like all our luggage here no, we've just brought nice. we've just brought our little suitcases because we'd already unpacked and stuff at french quarter as well hadn't we yeah. so it is handy to just bring like the little cases um but this room is crazy so we're on the bottom floor we've not got like a savannah view or anything um Do but you have our to pay more points for a savannah view i think yeah it's higher points um but we've got like a nice little view of like greenery and stuff and we've got a huge balcony um but yeah i'm gonna show you the room because it's crazy and i'm not sure we'll ever stay in a one bed villa again <laughs> um but there's two jacuzzi baths in no, just, just one jacuzzi oh, one bath. jacuzzi bath, one normal bath. Yeah. But that bathroom there is just like what we've got at French Quarter. Yeah. But then we've got a fancy one. But then we've got we? a fancy one. So I'll show you what the room looks like. Um so yeah, we got this um using like renting our friends DVC points. So thank you, Becky and Dean, Thanks, for Becky letting Dean. us um buy them off you. Yeah. I'm glad that they didn't go to waste. Also, um, um shout out Val. Oh yeah, Becky's grandma, she wanted us to give her a shout out in yeah, the vlogs, so. so hi Val, hi Val. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah I'm going to show you what the room looks like and yeah it's incredible, yeah, it's a madness, we're both it? just like sat here like looking round aren't we, I've never had so much space in a hotel room, but I feel like this is bigger than like the bottom floor, like our house, square um, footage, yeah probably, <laughs> I think it actually is, I think this room is bigger than the square footage of our house, the, like the downstairs of our yeah. house. 
I don't know actually. I reckon it might be. Probably. A similar size. Yeah, it's definitely a similar size. <laughs> so I'll show you like what it all looks like. So like I mentioned earlier, we're on like the ground floor. So it's technically floor two because you go down to get to like the grounds of the um, hotel and where the restaurant and stuff is. Um, but we're in room 7613 in case anyone's interested. And this is like a little map of Animal Kingdom Lodge. So we're over here in Kidani Village. Um, and the last time we stayed at Animal Kingdom Lodge, we were over in Jambo House, um, so it's nice to like explore this side. Um, so yeah, where it's circled on the map, like this is where our room is, and we've got some of the cute 50th um, room keys. So this is like a little overview of when you stood by the doorway. Um, so we've got like a little entrance hall kind of thing. <laughs> um, so on this side, we've got a washer, and dryer and they've actually left um, laundry detergent and this makes us sound really old but we have actually brought some washing to do while we're here because it just makes sense if we've got it we might as well use it rather than paying um, for the laundry things in the other bits of the hotel um, so we've got like a laundry basket and stuff up there. We've not brought loads, don't worry. So we're not going to be like doing that. But we thought it'd be easy to just set it going while we're out for tea. Um, the bathroom, like the standard bathroom is just on the opposite side. Um, so there's toilet and then a bathtub with shower. I love these um, tiles going round the sofa and then we've got the H2O body wash, shampoo and conditioner on the wall. Um, just standard like toilet, bin, towels. Um, and then we've got a little sink and mirror. Um, some H2O goodies over here. So we've got a facial soap and a body lotion. More towels. And then there's extra towels and toilet paper underneath, which is handy. And then into the main bit. So there is a door there, so I think this is a connecting room, um, but we'll just be keeping that locked. We've just popped our luggage there for the time being. We've got this cute little artwork on the back wall. And then we've got like a little kitchenette. I say little, it's not very little at all, it's massive. Um, so there's two stools there. So if you wanted to like have a little snack at the breakfast bar or something, then we could. Um, there's a sink, toaster, um, ice bucket, and then there's a little um, goodie bag. So there's dish soap, um, machine washing detergent, so if we were doing anything in the dishwasher, and like a little sponge and a tea towel. That's really cute that they leave that. Um, and then this here is the dishwasher, and then We've just got like a storage under the sink. We've got a bin and like washing basket thingamajig, draining basket if that's what it's called. And then just cupboard space over here with like um, dishes and colanders, things like that for if we were doing any cooking, which we're not gonna be because we've got a reservation at Sanaa. Um, and then there's drawers with utensils tea towels it's really good that they've got like all the amenities already in ben's just chilling over there <laughs> um we've got a big fridge and freezer which is very handy um obviously again we won't be utilizing this sadly but if you were here for like a few nights or a week or so it would be perfect um there's a microwave up there and then an oven and hob we've got coffee maker oh my god then look how much joffrey's you've got here to take with you <laughs> um but yeah loads of different coffees it's the 50th anniversary blend which ben very much oh, likes nice. um so that's the kitchen and then we've got like this little dining table which is very nice um so it's got a bench along the back wall and then two chairs and it's quite a decent sized table that isn't it table, yeah. yeah um and then some cute little um like clay art on the wall is it clay 
I know it's like metal. Um, painted like metal art on the walls. We've got like a big dresser, TV stand kind of thing. And then a huge TV up on the wall. We've got a light in the corner and then a little chair which we've just put our bags on for the time being. That's a little sneak peek of the view but I'll show that in a minute. Um, more nice artwork. We've got a big sofa that I think actually pulls out into a sofa bed as well. Um, and then just like a coffee table. We've got lamp, phone, little side table. And then in here is the bedroom. Oh my God. Oh, <laughs> Why do you always find a desk? <laughs> um, so we've got a huge like king size bed. Um, nightstands on either side. Oh. Is it comfy? Yeah. <laughs> and then another big dresser here. TV, so you can watch TV in bed if we wanted. There's one of those little um, things here for putting suitcases on, which is handy. And then, like Ben was modelling, we've got the desk. It's got like a little drawer in it, another phone. There's lots of plug sockets and USB ports, which is good. Um, we've got a nice mirror here. And then the other side of the balcony, so you can kind of get an idea of how big it is. Um, we've also got a chair in here more nice artwork there's lots of nice um things on the walls isn't there, there is. um, and we've got a fan in here so we can keep it nice and cool more um plug sockets and usb outlets and then this is the humongous bathroom you could so live in there couldn't you you could literally live in this but, like um i'll probably be echoing now on the um video so sorry about that um but we've got like a closet the extra pillows and blankets hangers huge safe and then iron and ironing board oh my god <laughs> <laughs> we've got a separate little toilet here which i quite like um because it means like if you're on the toilet you're not bothering whoever's in the bath <laughs> oh, oh yeah <laughs> such a weirdo you know. um so we've got a nice big sink unit in here bin extra towels extra toilet paper um little mirror on the wall which is one of the zoomy ones oh <laughs> um and then lights flannels more h2o goodies and then a nice big mirror I've already showed the towels I think and then we've got this huge shower again a really nice um tiles going all the way around Ben there's a seat in the shower <laughs> Ben loves it when there's oh. a seat in a shower <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> why does it make you so happy when there's a seat in a shower I don't understand it there's nobody else in the shower why have you got your so cozy <laughs> <laughs> so yeah the shower is there and we've got all the um h2 goodies is there a door to the shower or is it open one yeah door oh. bye hun bye and then oh another h2 bath soap and more little towels so there's lots of towels isn't there yeah. um and then this is the jacuzzi bath and it's got like a really big like ledge here, which is really random, but you could put like a drink or something on there while you're in the bath. You could buy some Have a candles. snack. You could buy some candles at the shop. Oh, I don't think they would allow you that. Can you set some candles up and... But yeah, this is crazy. It's really, really nice. You go out of the um, balcony that side. Oh, I'll make so I'm just going to show you out on the balcony now. Ben's going out on the um, other side of it so we can show you how big it is. So this is our view. Like I said, we've just got like loads of trees and greenery, but it's very pretty. It's really hot out here. Oh my God, I can smell something well good. What can you, can you smell that? How good does that smell? So yeah, this is our balcony. Where you been? <laughs> I'm not even at the end of it. Look how far away we are from each other. 
This would be perfect when we fall out with each other. I can sit at this end and you can sit at that end. But this is just so nice. Sorry about how you like bedraggled I look. I've got a lot to park her. But yeah, we're really excited to stay here tonight. Um, so like I mentioned, we've got a reservation at Sanaa, which is in about an hour. So we're going to get ready for that now. Um, and then go down there. Can't wait for the bread service again. Well, I'm looking forward to it. We're really looking forward to it. We've not done this meal since... 2018 or 2017 maybe like 2018. Um, so it'll be really nice to go back because we really loved that restaurant last it's time we went it. it is boiling it's humid go back isn't it <laughs> see you in the living room <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah it's really really oh my god it's nice and cool in here it smells so good in this room as well i don't know what it is but it just smells amazing um but yeah that is our one bedroom villa and we will see you in a bit we're going to snow nice to have all the it is Lovely. as much as i'm excited for sonara i kind of don't want to leave the room <laughs> <laughs> don't order any boots <laughs> get sonar take away <laughs> <laughs> on our way then to sonara and got our washing going in the back <laughs> Oh, Ben's turning all the lights on. Come on, hun. The bread service is waiting for us. So we've just checked into Sanaa. We've got a little pager for when our table's ready. Um, my hair's looking a bit crazy. Um, we've not had like showers or anything just yet um, because we were thinking we might go in the jacuzzi later on. Um, so there's no point having a shower and like washing the hair to then get it wet again. Um, so we just... Um, had a little freshen up. I just replied my hair and made it look a bit less messy, but I'm not sure if it's worked. Um, but we're very much looking forward to this, aren't we? Yeah. Um, so yeah, we're going to have this and then we'll probably go and have an explore of the resort and then maybe go and get in the jacuzzi later on. We're we'll probably get in the jacuzzi. If it's open till 11, it would be rude not to. <laughs> we'll have to have a look on the map, see where the one is in here. Huh? We'll have to have a look on the map, see where the, what, the, the, the jacuzzi is. Well, we'll go and have an explore round, see if we can see it, won't we? But yeah, we're going to head into Sanaa shortly when our table is ready. So the star of the show has just arrived, the bread service. So we've got five different flavours of naan. I can't remember exactly what she said. This spicy. one's a spicy one, this one's a garlic and something. Plain. Plain. This one's a wheat, wheat one, and, and then, then that's a plain chapati type an one. Onion, I think. Oh, onion, onion. Yeah, onion chapati. Um, and then we've got all of these sauces. So they go from mild over here, all the way around to like sweet, and then spicy ones here. Yeah, they're the two devil ones. <laughs> this but one this I'm looks happy. so good. I really hope that this is as good as we remember it to be, but I think it will be. And then we've both ordered butter chicken for our main, haven't we? But I've got mine with a seafood curry as well. And Ben's gone for braised beef. Um, so we're really looking forward to this meal. I'm so excited. Our mains have arrived. So this is the butter chicken, um, basmati rice, and then the going seafood curry. Ben says basmati rice, butter chicken, and then a braised beef. What kind of sauce is the braised beef? Is it like a curry? Or? I don't know. Not tried it yet. Not tried it yet. Still making our way through the bread service. <laughs> Um, which was delicious, just as good as we remember, if not, if not better. Just come back to the room to get our um, cozies back on. We're just going to go down to the jacuzzi, aren't yep, we? We are. We've got here. our um, resort mugs as well, so I'm going to take those, go and have a jacuzzi, have a dip, and then get our drinks and come back Jamming. to the room, just chill out. Um, I said chill out, it'll probably be late by the time we get back. So what well, time is it now? It's nine o'clock now. So we're gonna go to the jacuzzi for a couple of hours probably and then head back here. So we'll show you the jacuzzi if it's open. I hope it's open. The other one at was Dingy open was open until eleven. Eleven. No, the one at Jambo House was midnight, but last time we were there. Was it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. So fingers crossed Lovely. we'll be able to get in the jacuzzi. <laughs> We have had such a nice night chilling by the pool, haven't we? Yeah. Um, we were in the pool for about half an hour, 40 minutes maybe. Yeah. Um, and then it came over to the hot tub. There were like a few other people in it with us, but it's empty now. 
so this is the hot tub area there's like loads of sun lounges and just a little jacuzzi um we've currently just got two lounges here it's like almost 11 o'clock at night and it's still boiling isn't it yeah it's hot um so we've just been enjoying laying out um we've got like five minutes until it closes <laughs> so we might jump back in for like the last few minutes um but it's been so nice just sitting out and actually spending time like enjoying the resort suits you that bag Ben <laughs> so I'm just quickly ending the vlog because I think I forgot to do it like the past two nights um, but we're back at the hotel now well I say back at the hotel we're at the hotel anyway because we're at the pool but we're back in the room we've just showered got in our PJs and just getting in bed Ben's watching the basketball on TV and gonna go to sleep soon because we need to be up early tomorrow for our Boma breakfast um, and obviously to send our cases to Bell Services to move them back over to French Quarter for us um, but we already love this room we've not even spent the night in it yet and we already love it um, it's huge um, the shower was really really nice kind of wanted a jacuzzi bath but kind of didn't need one because we've been in the jacuzzi all night um but yeah gonna head off to sleep now and we'll see you tomorrow for animal kingdom <laughs> <laughs>